Hey guys, I'm pulling cards. I'm driving. It's my birthday. Um, anyways, back to what's important. I pulled the first card and I got this star, so I feel like this is Aquarius. And this is also for not just Aquarius, but if you're dealing with an Aquarius or you're a cross watcher or if you have any fucking thing to do with an Aquarius anywhere, okay? This could be your reading. But we're gonna see. So, like I said, the first card I pulled, card I pulled was the star. Um, so that is that Aquarian energy. That is that hope for that to take off. But I feel like, you know, the next card I pulled was the death in reverse, which tells me that either this part, this isn't going to be over with yet, or either maybe this person or you does not want it to be over with yet. Like you don't want it to end. You don't want it to come to an end. Um, I got a king of wands and that tells me that's something in fire and passion. There's a lot of passion and energy in this, um, this relationship. It doesn't necessarily mean that it's good. It doesn't necessarily mean that it's honest or that it's healthy, but it, it's there. There's a passion there that you can't deny. Um, but this person's, or you are refusing to make any um, investment in it. They are done learning what they need to learn from the situation. I feel like they have no choice. They feel like they have no choice, too, because it hurts them too bad. They don't want to be hurt by it anymore. They don't want to hurt you anymore. Um, then I pulled the Ace of Cups in reverse. And that tells me that that's not going to be a new investment in this love. They don't want to. They don't want to start new with this situation. Or that you don't, like I said. Um, so the strength in reverse shows me that they've come to that inner um, resignation. They've come to that inner peace with it. That there's no need to remain strong in this situation. There's no need to hold out for it because it's not, gonna, it's not going anywhere. Um, I don't know why that's what I'm getting from that, but that's what I'm getting from that. Let's see what else I'm pulling red lights so hot queen of coins all right so if this isn't you aquarius this is who you're dealing with okay this is the energy of um the pinnacles and like earth i think you know and taurus and virgo capricorn in fact it's the queen um, of coins tells me that you've got the energy of being independent for yourself and doing for yourself but that you still want that other part of it like you still want that completion of the the world and the life and the, the whatever is normal for this realm you know what i mean and that that would include the home and having things that come with the home and that includes maybe the white picket fence and the little person that's waiting there to kiss you on the door but I doubt that's really what I mean. You know what I mean? You know what I mean. Like, that's what you want, but you don't have to have it that way. Like, you want someone that will meet you at the door. They might not be a white picket fence. Who cares? But, you know what I mean. But that's what I feel like I'm getting from you. And as long as, you know, you can be in this queen of coins energy, and they can remain in this king of wands energy, and it's possible that it could work. But between you two, one of you is going to be more grounded, and the other one can be more passionate. And one may get bored. So, it's better to try to come to an even ground or meet, meet halfway with certain things and if someone doesn't believe somebody in certain situations maybe it's better to go ahead and air that instead of letting that sit and fester because that's just going to cause hidden um, resentment and then eventually that you know internal resentment will also become external resentment um, that's when things can't be reversed sometimes like that's when it gets to that point where people say and do things that are irreversible um you may be able to forgive them, but you can't forget. So, and a point it comes to a point where when you love yourself and you value yourself, you can't you can't forget how someone did you because all you have is their track record. Um, and until you let them prove you otherwise, that's what you have to go by. And that other when they're, when they're trying to prove it to you, that's always a very fickle time, and that's always a very um, like it's gambling almost. It's gambling because you don't know what you're going to get in the end because you already know what you think you're going to get and you're dumb for swim mark infested waters expecting not to get bit but you say well maybe i can just swim real fast <laughs> i don't know i feel like sometimes that's how we all feel but i, I get you aquarius or crawler i get you but um that's all i had and i hope you guys have a good one talk to you later